everyone, it's Caroline and I'm back to do another book review. It's a tween week and the tween book I just read is Jennifer Chan is Not Alone by Tay Keller. I was really excited for this book because Tay Keller won the Newbery Award for her previous book, When You Catch a Tiger. And whenever an author wins the Newbery Award, I'm always excited to see what they're going to come out with next. She did not disappoint with this book. Um, this book takes place in two different timelines, the then and the now. The then is when Jennifer first moves to a new town, and the now is when Jennifer goes missing. Mallory meets Jennifer when she moves across the street from her, and she's concerned about how Jennifer is going to be perceived at their middle school. Jennifer is obsessed with aliens. She believes they're real, and she wants to prove it and make contact with them. When she goes missing, Mallory doesn't know if aliens are involved, if Jennifer really did discover aliens, or if she's missing because of an incident that happened at school. Either way, she really wants to find Jennifer and bring her home. What I liked most about this book were the characters. I love Jennifer. I love how she is who she is, and she doesn't care what other people think about her. And Mallory is the complete opposite. She very much cares what people think about her, but that felt very true to how a middle school girl might feel. This book also has a lot of suspense. You don't know where Jennifer is. You don't know if aliens are involved or if they're real, and you don't know what this incident was at school. And the novel really builds to um, revealing what that incident was and where Jennifer actually is. Um, so I do recommend this book. I really enjoyed it. Again, it's called Jennifer Chan is Not Alone by Tay Keller. I read a physical copy of the book and you can too if you come into the library. You can do regular pickup, curbside pickup, or we have contactless pickup in our lobby. But if you feel more comfortable, you can get the ebook if you go to the National Digital Doorway or if you download the Libby app. Um, thank you so much for listening. Stay safe and healthy. And I'll be back next week to do another book review.